Speaking on the theme, Together We Are Stronger as We Move Towards a Brighter Horizon, EAW President Sherry Ann Nichols conveyed her expectations that members work together to expand on the original vision of the organization. As we continue to work together to increase in the membership of the branches, we must continue to keep the goal of enlightening the women of our nation of the safe and economical use of electricity. I give thanks to our sponsor, the Trinidad and Tobago Electricity Commission, for putting their trust in the members of the branches of this association to represent their organization throughout the years. And with that trust comes great responsibility. Education and training consultant and featured speaker for the event, Joanna Rock Collimore, invited members to reflect on the positive and negative impacts of electricity consumption and to look at the vision of a brighter horizon through the lens of sustainability. We must continue to innovate and develop technologies that minimize the environmental footprint of electricity generation and consumption. By investing in efficient technologies, promoting renewable energy sources, and advocating for responsible energy policies, we can ensure a more sustainable and eco-friendly energy future. Mrs. Rock Collymore gave the example of the smarter architectural choices we can make in reducing electricity consumption from air conditioning units. Young people, our children, are building homes, not a window, not a vent, not a anything, just four walls, and they have to air condition the whole house. Does that make sense? Long ago, we had verandas, we had jealousies, we had windows, we had all kinds of ways of allowing fresh air into our homes. So when we're talking about reducing, we, you and I, can make a choice. Mrs. Rock Collymore advised that we simplify our lives, reduce energy consumption, and leave a smaller carbon footprint as we move together towards a brighter future. Stacia Yearwood, TDT News.